Hi right, guys, I'm in my camper just relax relaxing and I was looking up parts for my uh, new golf cart because my old two stroker easy go model number or model model year seventy I think. I think seventy to seventy two they made them. <clears throat> but uh if if you're doing an oil change and a tune up, this is what you will need for a ninety two some parts are for ninety two to oh four and some are for ninety two to ninety six, but I'll tell you which ones are for which year I think. I'm not for sure which ones uh actually go up to O four but I'll tell you what I can tell you, and it's up to you to to take the old parts off, look at them, replace them with new ones, you know, go on the computer and uh, research your golf cart, you know, there's some out there that there's two alike, and there's 20 alike, you know. If, if 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 you had two golf carts that are, are that look the same and the motor is the same, but the the other ones are all four, and mine is a ninety two, well, it might it might work. It might work. But I'm I'm just gonna tell you here what's for my uh, ninety two club car. Um, if you guys look here. Sorry, it's not too bright, but 92 club car oil filter. Um, uh, let's see here. Original number was original uh, filter number. The original oil filter number that I found on the internet was number 10 3887901. Now it was replaced by. Uh, 10 16 46 7 if if you want the one of the originals that were on the golf cart but I'm just gonna tell you right now that these or these were like 10 or 11 or 12 bucks I think but I found a Fram uh, oil filter here. It's a uh, number PH4967. PH4967. Um, that filter there was like. Three seventy-seven or something. It, 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 it was around four bucks, but you, you can go to Walmart and get these in a four pack, and you can get them. Well, that's what I've seen on the internet anyway on Walmart.com. But you can get these in a four pack for oh, fourteen dollars, and you're around here anyways, and you're saving like a dollar eight or dollar or something. But then I found these Bosch oil filters this one here I couldn't find this uh, number 72167 so I crossed it out I couldn't find that one anywhere but here's a Bosch premium oil filter it's actually well I wrote no number 3311 but it's actually a D3311 um, spark plug what I found anyway for my golf cart was a NGK I, I like NGK 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 is the best spark plug I think but uh NGK spark plug number BP4ES and that I think is a gap of well um 
most small engines are gapped at 30 thousandths but I found on the internet that this spark plug is actually gapped at 29 thousandths so that's point zero two eight but if you're going 30 thousandths which I think you could go because it's only two more thousandths which is point zero three zero. now um, I talked to an older couple that we know here at the campground that has the exact same golf cart but it, it has a different engine in it and he uses pure 30 weight oil pure 30 weight so if you go and, and try and find a, bo a bottle of 30 weight oil it's going to say SAE 30 which is 30 weight oil which is actually what you're supposed to use in a small engine like a lawnmower and golf carts and all that stuff but I'm going to use 1030 1030 is just a little thinner than 30 weight so I'm going to use Valvoline Max Life Synthetic Blend 10W30 I'm going to get a 5 quart yeah, the reason I, I don't know how much the golf cart is going to take of oil but the reason I'm getting a 5 quart is because the neighbor has the old 4 golf cart that I was talking about later or earlier and I'll buy it he'll pay me back and then the reason why I'm going to buy 4 of these filters in a 4 pack is because the neighbor can buy 2 from me and I'll keep 2 for myself for well I'll put one on now with the new oil and both of them and we'll have a spare one next year now if you're looking for um, uh, drive belts or starter generator belt now I think this drive belt would work for a uh, 92 to 04 I think I think it's a number 1349 I think that belt was 30 32 33 bucks on the computer but you know that's with all shipping or anything now this starter generator belt here is um for a 92 to 96 I think but if you have a president's golf cart I don't know if that's what ours is or not but if you have one of those um, 96 to 04 I think it is or 04 to and up or something like that I don't know I, I can't remember too well. You'll have to look it up if you have that kind of golf cart. But the starter generator belt for 92 to 96 is number 10, 15, 24, 1. So it's 101524, 1. So, guys, this is just a. Uh, update of what I'm doing here, you know. There you go, guys, if you can read my handwriting. You can pause here and uh, get all the information you need and go from there. Um... Yeah, if, if, if you guys got a different engine in your golf cart or you don't know um, what engine there is, there's a serial number tag on the dash somewhere. Sometimes it's in the, it's in the uh, golf compartment. Um, you can look your golf cart up that way.
um, or you can take it to a shop and they can charge you hundreds of, do of dollars for doing this stuff, you know. I mean, if you take it to a shop around here, they're getting 75, 80 bucks an hour for a small engine shop, and that's with that's that's just the labor for an hour. So if if you know you could save yourself seventy five to eighty dollars around here, you know. You go and get the spark plug, your your belts, your uh, oil filters, oil, you know. And the tools that you're gonna need for this is a a rag or uh, um, for doing. Uh, this stuff here, you're gonna need a rag or shop tools, um, uh, oil filter wrenches or wrench, uh, spark plug sockets for the spark plug, um, oil funnel or funnel and any funnel will work you know if if if, if you just use a old uh, s small pot bottle that'll work too you know just cut the end, the bottom of it off um, to replace the drive belt and start a generator belt you're probably I, I don't know about this for sure but you're probably probably gonna need um, a long flathead screwdriver or even a uh, a long skinny uh, pry bar but uh, thanks for watching guys uh, uh, if you got any questions or whatever here uh, comment and I'll I'll see if I can find the right answer for you or whatever, you know. But, uh, thanks. See you later.